hello everyone welcome to my channel today i have a very important video for you guys so one of my subscriber just suggested me to make a video on how to make your pc optimized for pubg emulator especially on the pc that is not so upgraded so i'm making this video especially for those guys who have average pc who have don't have high configuration pc so in this video i'm gonna tell you every single tips and tricks how you can optimize your gameplay performance in pubg emulator session technique the first one you need to use windows latest version so so click on this here and search and write cmd and here you can check your windows version suppose you have to write winvr winvr to get the uh, version that you are using if you are not using the latest version you just need to upgrade it so it is recommended that you would update it to the latest version of your windows 10 so that you can get the optimal performance and then you need to upgrade your graphics card driver okay graphics card driver so that you get updated version of your gameplay then you need to set your windows to best performance mode now now i'm going to show you how to do that so go there and click uh, right button of your mouse and go to properties and go to advanced system setting and while you go to the advanced system setting just click on this uh, advanced button and in the performance you see visual effect processor scheduling memory uses and virtual memory you need to click setting and here you have the option to set your performance option you just need to set to adjust to best performance and click apply and click ok and it will be done and then for this step you need to set your power management to high performance so you need to go here again and you need to search power management okay so click on this power and system setting and you have to go additional power setting click on this button and here you see balanced power saver and high performance so i recommend you to go to the high performance mode if you want to prefer good performance in pubg emulator so click on this and restart your pc if you need it because high performance when you click on this high performance you need to restart your pc to get the proper performance and the fifth step is you need to clear all those temp file and temp a percentage temp file from your run okay so you need to click windows button and r to go to the run and you need to just type percent temp and percent and click ok and you need to delete all of those things just select uh, control a to select all and shift delete to delete all of those files okay so just delete all those files so all of those is clean so again you need to click uh, windows button and r and type temp and click ok and you need to just select all of them and shift delete all of those files and after you clear your temp and temp percentage temp file and set your power management to high and you set windows performance to best mode you need to just install your pubg in ssd now in some people don't have ssd so they have to install on hdd which is not optimal for pubg emulator good performance so always you need to use uh, ssd to run the pubg in the most smoothest performance to get the highest performance from pubg you need, must have to install your pubg emulator on ssd and it will make your gameplay load faster load your map faster everything will be amazing and you get an optimal performance in pubg emulator so uh, if you are on tight budget just buy 128 gb ssd and get the best performance and the next part we have give high priority to pubg in nvidia control panel setting or amd control panel setting you need to set the priority to high in pubg emulator so let me see how we can do that so right click on your mouse and go to nvidia control panel so here you will go to the manage 3d setting on on the 3d setting panel you go to manage 3d setting and here you have two options one is global setting and one is program setting go to program setting and here you will select your gameplay or the exe file or apk file whatever you want to do you have to select a program to customize so whichever program you select this one will get the best performance okay so i need my pubg emulator this one to get the maximum performance okay so i select this one and click on add okay so you can select all the application now i'm selecting this game loop because this is the program that i want to run perfectly and faster okay so i'm clicking this one and add selected program click on this and it will be added you can add multiple application see i have added all of those things and click okay you can also restart your gameplay after this which is be really good for your gameplay 
so after you add all those things you need to go to power management tool here power management mode you need to select this one and you need to select prefer maximum performance okay i'm selecting maximum performance so that i can get optimal performance from this and uh, click on this apply so i have selected this to prefer maximum performance so it would be really good so the next trick is that don't run anything in the background while you are gaming on this pc because your pc is not so updated your processor is 9 years old 10 years old your ram is only 8 gb and ddr3 so you don't need to run anything in the background while you are gaming so this is the most recommended thing and the final step is you need to tweak emulator setting based on your pc configuration so let me show you how to do that so on game loop click on this uh, hamburger icon and update it if there is an update so go to the setting in setting we have basic engine game all of those things so first go to game and select your resolution if your monitor is suppose 1080p you need to select HD 1080p for high performance but if your monitor is not full HD uh, only 19 inch then you should use uh, SD 720p resolution so that would be perfect for you and in display quality you always should use smooth if you have low configuration pc but if you have high configuration pc you must go to hd which is the best okay so go with smooth and click save and in engine we have opengl directx directx opengl plus directx plus and smart mode now you have to select smart mode because it always uh, gives you the optimal performance based on your pc configuration if your pc is high configuration it will select the directx plus or opengl plus if it is low configuration it will select opengl and directx automatically okay so that's why it is a smart mode so you should uh, select the smart mode and if you have high configuration pieces just you can select any of those two this will have more cpu just but it will give you the best performance so i'm selecting a smart mode because it will select automatically which is suitable for this pc and you need to uh, check all of those things render cache enforce global render cache and prioritize dedicated gpu if you have extra uh, graphics card in your system you just click on this otherwise you just uncheck it okay and click all of those things and anti-aliasing you based on your pc configuration you can select anything but i'm selecting balanced you can also select ultimate for high configuration pc and memory i'm just selecting only 4 gb if you have a lot of memory you can select this one and in processor i have four core processor so i am using four here if you have eight core processor you will select eight or if you have dual core you just select two okay so i'm selecting four here and my resolution is the monitor resolution i'm using which is full hd 1080p and dpi is 480 for high configuration but i have low configuration pieces so i am selecting 160 and this is the optimal performance for this piece actually you just tweak all of those things and see whichever performance give you the best performance i am just telling you that this gives me the best performance as it is a nine years old cpu but it's still it is a really good performance in this setting now after this save this so here in the game setting is it 1080p and it is uh, telling you that you have to have a graphics card of gtx 660 or higher i have 964 gb so it is the best suitable for me if you have a 1060 or 1660 ti or 1650 super or 1660 graphics card nvidia or equivalent to md you can select ultra hd2k for the high graphics and gameplay and smooth setting is the best for this pc and hd 1080p for my graphics card so 4 gb graphics card is suitable for 1080p so i am using this if you have 6 gb or 8 gb you can select this ultra hd 2k this is would be the best performance okay so after selecting all of those things you just uh, save and just close your game loop i'm just closing my game loop and then just restart your pc and it will be giving you very good performance and just in the last i want to say that don't run anything in background while you are gaming so these are the top things that you need to understand while you are want to play pubg emulator game in most optimal setting and give the best performance and while you are gaming you make sure that so this is all the techniques that i know guys to tell you about pubg emulator gameplay setting so uh, subscribe to my channel and give likes and comments in in the description i'll be giving you all the tips and tricks in the upcoming videos uh, so keep in touch with me and uh, click on this bell icon so that you get the latest content from my youtube channel so thanks for watching guys i'll be catching up with the next video